Jonah, you there? that has existed since the time before Christ. They are determined to find and exploit all of the ancient artifacts of the world. I've been hunting them since I found out they killed my father. Jonah and I have tracked down so many Trinity cells since then. But all of the other ruins and tombs we found were destroyed, except the one in Cozumel. I need to find out what they're after, what their endgame is, and stop them. Jonah, I'm out. Be careful, the way into the site is full of traps. Trinity's not done with it yet. They're protecting something. Six weeks, and still no solid leads on who's leading the local Trinity cell. But I talked to some people in town, and they're excited. There's a VIP coming to the Day of the Dead. Name's Dominguez. We should look into it. <clears throat> I made it. I'm on my way in. Almost there. 
Sorry I didn't wait. Be careful. Laura! Wow. Get a load of this place. Guess all that research paid off. Now we know what Trinity is after. Yeah, they really didn't want us in here. I'm glad we followed your father's notes. Mm-hmm. I saw where the passage collapsed on you back there. You want me to take a look at that wound? No, I'm fine. What is all this? Constellations. This inscription is some sort of riddle. Pink fish. Pink fish? Silver crowned mountain. There's a date here. But something's off. It looks like it was damaged, perhaps intentionally. Why would Trinity sabotage this? They usually just destroy everything. No, I think the damage is older. Laura! We gotta get help. Drag me out, I'd still be in there taking pictures. We'd still be in there. Don't know if you'd be doing much. Tona. Hey, you want to freshen up? Regroup at the cafe? Dr. Dominguez is supposed to be there tonight. Sounds good. I'll try and decipher the riddle, see if the date has anything to do with it. Right. Pink fish, Silver Crown Mountains, I'll look into it. By the way, this cafe is supposed to have really good food. I know the chef. Yeah, I'm not very hungry. <laughs> After all of that, I'm sorry. Anything new on Dr. Dominguez? Not much. He's leading a few Trinity digs in the area. My father mentioned him in his journal more than once. He's an expert on pre-colonial ruins. Everyone says he's a great guy. Big help to the town. So how's your leg? Turn a look. The riddle. Its directions, to find the hidden city, go south along the shore until you find the pink fish. I, I found something for that. It's pink dolphins, found only in the Amazon. It goes on, um, then chase the heart of the serpent to the silver-crowned mountain. Look at this. It's the constellation Hydra, the serpent. This star is the heart. It's set in the southwest. So southwest from the Amazon River, Brazil. This date from the ruin, see? If you look closely, it is damaged. This number looks like a Maya 13, but what if it's really an 8? With procession, it... What? Uh, procession. 
the Earth tilts, so over time these stars appear in a different place on the horizon. Important if you're navigating by the night sky. Okay. In the Maya calendar, that's a 2,000 year difference. Back then, the heart of the serpent set directly to the west. So, that's why it's in Peru, not Brazil. Trinity has been looking in the wrong place. Exactly. We need to look for the silver crowned mountain in Peru. There's more. Um, something about uh, a key. What is Trinity looking for in the hidden city? Doctor, we found it. Yes. Show me. You heard that too, right? Let's see where he goes. Wait, hold on. Trinity's watching this place. Let's try to blend in. Trinity's people are armed. I heard they brought in reinforcements. I'll stay out of their way. I want to avoid what happened with the last cell we took down. They must know we were at the other site. So much for a night off. Where did Dominguez go? He can't be far. He must be in the courtyard somewhere. Yeah. Let's look around. Someone must know something. Yes, sir. How's it going? Let's keep looking. Can you believe it? This one was caught drinking the ofrendas. <laughs> oh dear. I'm sure I was just as mischievous as a child. No need to punish him. But tequila will take care of that on its own. He drank it. Any sign of him? Let's keep looking. Maybe I could light one for my mother. I'm not really used to crowds. You'd rather storm guards or the devils? <laughs> no, this is fine. Jonah, he's at the gate. You've certainly made an impression with the locals. I like it here. Good people. Dahlias. They were my mother's favorite. Good. Be sure I'm not following. I think I can find another way over the wall. I'll take care of these guys. How you doing? Good. You can't come through this way. I heard there was some kind of a crazy guest, like chicks and skull makeup. Y'all know anything about that? It's not for tourists. Uh, no, you know, Maria invited me. You know her? She's my cousin. My abuela, she was from here, don't look like it. Um, I, I wanted to make like an offering. Or, what's that thing you do with the blankets? All right. Uh, you know what? I can see you guys are busy. I won't waste any more of your time. Y'all keep on trucking. Thanks for your service. Keep it us safe. Jonah, I'm in. Good. Those guards weren't at the gate earlier. Dominguez must suspect something. 
Jonah is a survivor and a good friend. I met him several years ago on my first expedition on board the Endurance. He made me laugh the first time I spoke to him, calling me Little Bird. We've been through so much since then, and after I lost touch with my best friend Sam, Jonah was always there for me. He came with me to Katash and helped me find the divine source, the artifact my father was looking for when he was killed. After I destroyed the divine source to keep it from Trinity's hands, Jonah helped me hunt them down, cell by cell. When I finished deciphering my father's notes, Jonah thought the Cozumel was the best place to start. At first, I didn't believe him, but he was right. The site in Cozumel was the only one we found that wasn't destroyed. Now I know why. Trinity knows there's a piece of the puzzle missing, and I need to find out what it is before they do. Excuse me. Jonah, Dominguez is not just the leader of the cell, I think he's the leader of Trinity. We need to be careful. Laura. Yeah, yeah, I heard you. My fault. They might have noticed me. I'll try the back alley. I'll find another way around. Sorry. Close the door when you leave. Right. 
right. Don't worry. Go. Hey. The readings at the site are unlike anything you've ever seen. We'll to our next phase. If this is it. Jonah, they've entered the dig site. It's fenced off and there's a guard at the gate. I'll find another way in. I found a good spot. I'll watch the perimeter. There's got to be more to these ruins. A Maya pyramid inside some sort of cave. work for Trinity. What did they find? Well, they've been searching for a temple entrance for many years. Today they found it. I have to go warn my sister. She's on her way here now. Jonah, Trinity just tried to kill a local archaeologist. Oh, God. I have to find what they're looking for. This is Commander Rourke. All teams. Get ready for Operation Blackout. I better check those ruins. <clears throat> I better take a look at those ruins. <laughs> I better take a look at those ruins. I know 
this figure? Ishel, the goddess of the full moon. Oh, and this is Shakshal, the new moon. It's an inscription. Shakshal, the key lies beyond her gaze. The key? This is it. The entrance must be down there. Got to make my way down. Ishel and Shakshal are two faces of the same goddess. Ishel is the young woman and represents life and healing. She's associated with the full moon. Shakshal is the old woman and represents death. She is associated with the new moon. Together as the twins, symbols of duality in the cycle of life and death. Looks like it's usually underwater.
The carvings on this Maya monolith are far too deteriorated to read. holding cells. pre-Columbian ceramic jar seems to be depicting two gods in conversation. I can't quite make out the glyphs between them. Oh, smells vaguely fungi.
find the temple Dominguez is looking for. causing tremors. There's a pyramid. I'm gonna get to the top.
good. There are platforms that can help me reach the top. Looking for something to weigh them down. You're breaking up. Got some activity here. I'm gonna get closer. Have to raise that bell somehow. to raise that bell somehow. A secondary party, a few days behind the main pilgrimage, reported strange things on the route. The beasts had become more ferocious, and the jungle itself more dangerous. The trees and vines gnarled and twisted, growing thorns as long as a man's finger and sharp as blades. Those worthy shall be sacrificed to the Red Goddess, she of the waning moon and she of the waxing moon, grandmother to all, life taker and birth giver. destroy that debris. Need to find a way to destroy that debris.
find a way to destroy that debris. There's a mural here. It shows a box. Inscription says, The Silver Box of Ishal. That must be what's in the Hidden City. This is a Maya myth. It says the box will summon the god Kugul Khan. The creation god. Is that what Trinity's after? Wait, there's more. Looks like a series of cataclysms. A tsunami. A storm, an earthquake, volcanic eruption. So much for the god of creation. Well, in my belief, Kugul Khan is the god of creation and destruction. Hmm. This looks like the Hydra constellation, but the stars seem out of alignment. A dagger. There's an inscription. The key to Isha's heart unlocks the cleansing. We can't let Trinity get hold of this. Let's think this through. Hey, shit! Laura! Trinity guards are coming your way. Get to higher ground. Oh no, you took 
hurry. This dagger is the key of Shack Shell. I found an inscription near. Dr. Dominguez and more men. Apparently we found what we're looking for. Great. And the siege begins. Yeah, that's what the reinforcements are for. sure everything's copacetic here.
I hope with me. You know I've been interested in your work. Trinity always is. <laughs> the key of Sasha. I've sacrificed my life. in a safe place. You don't have it. It never occurred to me that you would just take it. With this key and the silver box, we can remake the world. Without witness, cruelty. And certainly with none of this. But without the box. The apocalypse. The death of the sun. You're lying. Lara. You felt it when you took the key. Tremors are common. A tsunami is coming. This is the first of many catastrophes you're doing! You would have done the same!
Advancing has begun. It falls to me now to stop it before it consumes us all.
Who was so worried? I failed. Was. What do you mean? Dominguez. He has the dagger. I lost it. After everything that my father went through, I gave Trinity exactly what they wanted. He'll use the box and the knife to remake the world. To remake it into what? I don't know. He, he thinks he can rid it of sin and weakness. A man like that, we... We have to stop him. It's all my fault. We'll figure it out, okay? I, I promise. No, 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 no! We have to get to the hidden city before Trinity. We have to find the silver box. Okay, but first, we're going to help these people get to safety, and then we'll go after the box. No, no one is safe! Not if he gets the box first! I have to go! I'm the only one! You're the only one that can what? You don't know that you caused all this, Laura! Not everything is about you! These people need us here. We can do good now! Besides, what do we got to go on? A riddle? We're gonna need more than pink fish and silver crowns to get to the hidden city. I'm gonna help these people. And then I'll find us a plan. I think we're looking for a volcanic mountain. The crown of silver is probably a band of clouds. I just can't get those people back there out of my head. They lost everything. The riddle says... Chase the heart of the serpent to the Silver Crown Mountain, where the twins confer. I wonder what the twins are. <sighs> this storm looks like bad news. It's just a little rain. We'll concentrate on the Cloudy Mountain. Cloudy Mountain. If we find it, how do we know we have the right one? Gut feeling? It's our only clue. The mural says there'll be more disasters. The best way we can help them is to put a stop to it and Trinity. Okay. But how do we really know? Jonah, what I felt when I took the dagger. You mean the tremors of the tsunami? More than that. It felt like I woke something up. I know that it's not practical, I know that it's hard to believe, but you need to trust me. We have to trust each other. Hey, I might have something over here. Really? That's it! I don't like this storm. Should we come back in the morning? We're so close. I guess a little turbulence wouldn't stop Trinity either. Miguel, is there anywhere to land? Yeah, I can put you down near Kuat Jaku. Let's go. Like 
Take it, Monty. Oh, my God. 